Hi everybody, it's Dave Altavilla for HotHardware.com and we're here with a quick take look at the HP EliteBook 8440W mobile workstation. It's a 14 inch LCD based notebook with a native resolution of 1600 by 900 on its panel. Very crisp, uh, sharp panel. Um, it is a compact thin machine, but we wouldn't exactly say it's a light machine. This machine is built for the workstation and business professional. This is built like a tank. It's got a metal composite uh, finish, you know, gun metal finish on top here, which is really nice, actually fingerprint resistant. And uh, underneath is a standard plastic composite casing. But the machine is very well built, very solid in the hand and uh, a little on the heavy side, quite frankly, for a 14 inch machine. But if you don't mind a little extra weight, certainly the construction and build quality uh, and sturdiness will serve you well moving forward. Our machine is based on an Intel Core i7 uh, M620 processor at 2.67 gigahertz. It's got four gig of DDR3-1333 system memory and a 320 gig Seagate hard drive on board. And it's also infused with NVIDIA Quadro FX 380M mobile graphics with 512 meg of dedicated video memory. Let's take a look around the machine a little bit and uh, show you what some of the different features are. Okay, so here we are in tight on the keyboard area of the Elite Book and it's also very well built. The keyboard itself absolutely has no play or sponginess whatsoever. The keycaps are very responsive and tactile as well. They have a nice feel to them um, and a fair bit of springiness. So, you know, very responsive, uh, very comfortable uh, typing surface. The top area of the machine has an illuminated touch panel with various functions. You can turn volume up or down, you can mute, you can enable or disable the trackpad, enable or disable your wireless adapter, and fire up a web browser all from these illuminated touch buttons here. We should also mention that the hinges themselves are also a full metal construction, and it adds a real nice rigidity and uh, solid feel to the lid uh, being able to close and open the lid. And the lid itself is also encased in that metal finish. We again have the gunmetal uh, finish. And um, so the whole lid area of the machine is, is also very sturdy and uh, very solid feeling. Um, you know, a lot of reliability built into this machine. Let's take a look at some other features. On the front edge of the system, you'll find the Elite Books lid release button and it's also made of metal it's very sturdy and if you look closely here you'll notice that there are actually pins that come down and meet with sockets on the base of the system so the clasp is actually very firm and secure and again almost an industrial design approach that HP took with the Elite Book in terms of fit and finish and feel. Uh, in the front here is a speaker grill area as well as a SD MMC flash card reader slot. On the left edge of the system are microphone and headphone ports, as well as an express card 54 slot, a mini display port right there, and three USB ports. There's also a vent cut in the side of the casing here to exhaust air from the heatsink and fan assembly on the processor. On the right edge of the system is a standard telephone modem jack, a gigabit ethernet port, and this is unique. It's a combo eSATA USB 2.0 port right there. And then of course we've got our Super Multi DVD RW combo drive with LightScribe. And over here is a fingerprint reader. And finally, one of the bullet point features of the EliteBook 8440W mobile workstation is that it incorporates the NVIDIA Quadro FX 380M mobile graphics processor under its hood. And as you can see, we're running Cinebench release 11.5 right now, the OpenGL portion of that test, and it's running quite fluidly. So you've got a little bit of additional workstation class graphics horsepower under the hood for this notebook. Stop by our site for the full review with all the benchmark details. I'm Dave Altavilla with the HP EliteBook 8440W mobile workstation. Thanks for stopping by.